the Moose Mischiefs YouTube channel, where we have a fantastic time learning about our amazing world through craft, art, and science projects. Today, we're gonna to make a brown bear finger puppet. Brown bears are found in mountains and forests throughout North America, Europe, and Asia. Brown bears like to eat a variety of foods, including salmon and berries. In the winter, when food is scarce, they hibernate in their dens. That means they sleep all winter long without getting up once, not even to eat or drink. They can spend up to seven months sleeping. Can you imagine sleeping that long? Okay, now that we've learned about brown bears, let's get started. Here's what you need. Light brown, black, and white paper, a piece of dark brown cardstock paper, otherwise your puppet will be too flimsy. A black marker, scissors, glue, a circle hole punch, or you can use scissors for that part of the project. You also need to go to my website, moosemischief.com, and print off the bear template. And you also need a pencil. The first step is to cut out the bear's body, his head, and his arm. Once you have the bear cut out, you're gonna flip him over and trace him onto the brown cardstock paper. You're gonna to wanna to trace this arm twice so you have two arms. Let's cut it out. Okay, so now you're gonna go back to the template and pick up the bear's head. Cut out the bear's snout and the inside of his ears. Place them upside down on the light brown paper and then trace it. I bet you can guess what's next. Let's cut it out. Remember that snout? Let's pick it back up and cut out the nose. Once you have it cut out, place it upside down onto the dark brown construction paper and trace it. Okay, pick back up the bear template and you're gonna cut out the eye. Place the eye upside down on the white construction paper and trace it. You'll wanna trace it twice so you have two eyeballs. Pick up your eye and cut out the pupil. Place the pupil onto the black construction paper and trace it twice. Now we need to glue it together and draw in the bear's happy smile. So if you're lucky enough to own a hole punch, you can use it now to put in the holes for your finger puppet. Okay, so now you have a finger puppet. But if you're not lucky enough to own one of these, I'm gonna show you another way to get the holes for your finger puppet. You wanna draw circles like this on your puppet, just like that. So see how there, so there's two holes just like that for your fingers. Then you want to take your pencil and push a hole through the paper, just like that. And then I'll take my scissors, and I'm going to put my scissors right in that hole, and I'm going to cut it to the edge, and I'm going to cut around on the circle I traced. I have a little hole for my fingers. And you'll just want to do that again on the second one. Okay, so we've got our bears, and now that you have it all done, you can put on some music and have a dance party. I had so much fun making these dancing bear finger puppets with you. If you had fun too, like the video below, share it with a friend, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. To learn more about Moose Mischief, visit my website, moosemischief.com. I have t-shirts and sweatshirts for sale featuring my characters, Cooper and the Moose. I'm also selling my book, Moose Mischief, a pancake surprise. 
In the book, the moose claims he's the best chef in Alaska, but is he really? Buy the book to find out. <laughs>